your CBS 46 News update. Good evening, I'm Sean Gables. Tonight, one man dead, another person injured following a shooting in Buckhead. It happened at the Peachtree Battle Shopping Plaza on Peachtree Road. The other victim, a man, was found near the Treehouse Restaurant and Pub. According to police, the victim was walking to his car and saw another man attempting to break in. So the victim started shooting and the suspect returned fire then fled the scene. Tonight, the investigation continues. Right now, Atlanta Crime Stoppers offering a cash reward for information leading to the capture of Devontae Childs. Childs is wanted in connection to an August 17th homicide that happened at the Orchard Park Shopping Center in Sandy Springs. Childs is believed to be hiding in the Cleveland, Ohio area. If you know anything, please call Crime Stoppers, the number you see on your screen. CBS 46 is your vaccine team. An urgent new report from the CDC says that unvaccinated Americans are 11 times more likely to die from COVID-19 than vaccinated Americans. The study looked at COVID-19 cases, hospitalizations, and deaths in 13 states. Here in Georgia, more than 6,500 new cases were reported on Friday, 128 deaths. In Clayton County, students at Sequoia Middle School, in, that's in Riverdale, they're going to temporarily move to virtual learning for two weeks due to a surge of COVID cases in that area. Meals will still be available for students. Students and staff will return on September 27th. And remember, CBS 46 has continued coverage with the latest coronavirus and vaccine updates 24-7 online. Download our free mobile app to get alerts sent directly to your smartphone. A beautiful night and a beautiful weekend. Cool temperatures once again will be in the upper 50s and low 60s with low humidity as you wake up Saturday morning. Then Saturday afternoon, low to mid 80s, lots of sunshine, just overall a gorgeous weekend. Monday, Tuesday will be warmer, highs in the upper 80s, but it will stay dry. So from now through Tuesday, no rain at all, but those rain chances increase starting on Wednesday. This has been your personal news update from CBS 46 News.